what's going on there guys welcome back to more spider-man miles morales i hope you're enjoying these little um odd videos for spider-man uh i have i'm actually recording this intro like a couple of days after i recorded this video it was a bit weird um but i actually forgot to do an intro uh, i didn't want to just get straight into the action about at least you know intro in the video but i hope you're enjoying the videos honestly these next couple of videos I've done, they were, they were really special ones, especially the couple of suits we get were mint as anything. They were so nice. There's also one that was quite a good message, there's one that had a good reason behind the suit as well, so obviously stay tuned for that and watch through the entire videos. Let me know what, what suits you prefer. If you let me know what suits you like, I'll do more videos in that suit and I'll try other abilities. Do different challenges. The one thing what I have had on my mind is um, when I started this series, I had a problem with my audio equipment. Uh, the stuff I obviously want to record my commentary on. I didn't have the equipment I do now. Um, I actually use a headset with like a, a microphone on it. I kind of do it that way. I can it's the only way I can do it right now. I didn't have this when I did the series. So what I've been thinking, I've been, I kind of regret not being able to do a series with commentary and I don't know if that puts some people off watching the main series. If it is, please let me know down in the comments. If you want me to redo, but probably not yet because this is still very fresh. If you want me to do this series again, full commentary and everything, it'll only be the main story. But it won't take me too long, so I don't mind doing it if you want me to do it. So please let me know down in the comments, please like this video, subscribe to the channel if you're new and as I said to every video, thank you so much if any of my videos you've been watching, I appreciate you all and from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much, I'm the Hawkeye Punisher, I will let you continue to watch this video. <laughs> doing Spider-Man things. I'm still getting used to that. Reminds me of when I used to call your dad at work. Sometimes I'd catch him on patrol, or he'd have to shout over sirens. Did you ever call when he was making a bus? One time. He was taking in a felon to skip bail. The guy wriggled out of his cuffs and his pants to make a break for it. Your dad had to chase him down fifth. I was on the phone for the whole thing. No way. You serious? Serious. Best part? People took pictures and it made the bugle. <laughs> Your dad was not happy. Made him the butt of a lot of jokes at the station. But <laughs> nice one, Ma. I did not mean to do that. Either way, awesome story. So what's up? Did you need something? No, I just wanted to hear your voice and make sure you're okay. I'll let you go. Bye, honey. Love you. Bye. Danica, I'm at an underground hideout. Perfect. You handle the jammer and I'll see what I can dig up. We're stronger than ever.
I was able to ping an IP address, and it led me to an online underground forum, and it is gold. Really? Have you found anything good? Like how they started? They were one of the mafia. We started with assaults and robberies, and went after bigger groups so they could earn a reputation. Like, oh, inner demons. Fighting us was a mistake, Spider-Man! <laughs> Time to shut down the jammer. Let's see where it is. Wire run outs. Probably a good place to start. <sighs> Demon stuff. Need to shut down the jammer. Hey. Hideout's back on the grid. Nice. Tipping the cops off now. I can't wait to write up this underground demons conflict for my podcast series. Thanks, Spider-Man. That's my cue to leave. Margin for error. Easy. You got this. Doing good, Miles. Keep moving. Just gotta trust my gut. Keep an eye on the checkpoints coming up. You need to plot a course on the fly. Swinging challenge that's really about in the moment problem solving. Nice mentoring, Pete. <laughs> Walked by Roxxon Plaza the other day, and honestly, hey! Almost there, Miles. Keep back. Never really appreciated Central Park till now. Love this place. Another Christmas gone. And another Christmas. You sure put the zing in amazing, Miles. Carve your own path challenge complete. Here's a trick. Invert your web shooter nozzle. Trust me. Gives you the force you need for a second mid-air zip. Real lifesaver, that one. Pete! Hey. 
Now that my mom knows about, you know, how much do you think I should tell her? Like, should you tell her about every cracked rib and supervillain with a vendetta? That is tough. I never had to face that question with May. I worry if I'm too open, she'll stress out. But if I hold back, she'll stress even more. I don't know. Your mom's pretty good with stress. I mean, she did go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Roxanne. Talk it out. Find out how much she wants to know, and how much you're comfortable sharing. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's good advice. Hey, Danica. I'm at the underground hideout on the Upper East Side. Cool. You look for the jammer, I'll start pulling records for what the underground's been up to here. These new weapons are serious upgrade. Someone who mixes beats, I uh, I know a guy. That would be amazing, because I am totally tone deaf. Now I just need to find the jammer and shut it down.
Shouldn't be too heavy. And it wasn't. There's the jammer. They kept trophies from their fights with Tombstone. How sentimental. Did those mannequins move? Oh! Never want to see another mannequin. Hey, hideout should be back on the grid. Okay, tipping off the cops. Cool. I'm gonna chase the Tombstone Underground Partnership lead for my series. I should head out before the cops get here and cover everything in crime tape. Hey, I've been checking on all the hideouts we've shut down. Recruiting's tanked, and those blocks have gotten way safer. That's great. Thanks for calling them in. I wouldn't have found the jammers without you. So, I was looking through my files. It seems like the Tinkerer was working on some big secret project in Hell's Kitchen. Is it new form related? No, it looks like... programmable matter? Maybe I should grab it before someone else does. Oh, hey, there's a code referenced here. 2658. Maybe try that if you find something, you know, blocked? 2658, got it. Thanks again, Danica, for doing your podcast. Those tips at the end of your episodes have been life-changing. Oh, well, well, I'm glad. Thanks. When my Underground series is out, let me know what you think. Sounds good to me. Talk to you later. I think the underground's got a permit. Getting reports of the underground messing with a billboard nearby. Locating the source. Got the signal. Time to move. Underground's trying to get the press to notice them more. Maybe they should launch an app. And bingo! The underground. Oh, it's not even a challenge! Where he go? Somebody get him! Don't pay for that! Signal's clear. I should ask Genki about building some sort of underground ad blocker. of their days partnering with two Tombstone. Yep, you heard that right. They worked together off and on until an underground killed one of Tombstone's people. 
Q violence you. The underground were horribly, hopelessly outgunned. Then Tombstone was hauled off to prison, and not long after, the Tinkerer became their new leader and supplier. You can find more details on my blog. Till next time, try to tackle your hardest work between 2 and 3 p.m. Seriously, you're at peak attention span then. Bye! Six five eight, right? Programmable matter. I can make this into anything. Oh, I'm digging this. Think that'll do it. I gotta thank Danica for the tip. Time to up my selfie game. How can they have a shootout with this many civilians around? I gotta step in. everybody. Bystanders are safe. Time to head out. Good news, friends. My sources say underground activity has subsided significantly. The Tinker is officially presumed dead. We survived the storm of the century, and our looms are here. But New Yorkers must remain ever vigilant. This is the greatest city on Earth, which means there will always be lunatics trying to make a name for themselves by disrupting the tranquility of our daily life. One minute you're washing down a delicious everything bagel with a fresh cup of Pana Fuerte coffee, the next minute not one, but two mass menaces run by your window, and you discover the hard way that scalding hot is great. I ain't stop until you ain't free!
more convicts loose. All right, there's the photo requester. Spider-Man, hi. I know you're busy, but could I get a selfie with you? Yeah, sure thing. Oh my god, thank you. Pose right there. Huh? Huh? Uh, gotta run. Hope it turned out okay. It's great. Oh. If I web up the busted parts. Ah, oh, more ruptures open. This pipe is not up to code. That worked. Oh, come on. Good. Gotta put that fire out. Please work. Here we go. And the fire department should be here soon. No, I don't know what happened. Come on, my paper. Thanks, Spider-Man. Never seen a gas line blow like that. Good thing you got here as fast as you did. It's all good. I was in the neighborhood. Other guys are telling me you got an app. I'm usually bad with technology, but for you, I'll check it out. What are you? Ah, looks like I got another request from Friendly Neighborhood. App says I've got a gift waiting for me. I'll take a look before someone grabs it. Neighbors, Miles. Hey, do you have a basin wrench? Um, maybe in my dad's stuff. I can check. Yeah, would you? You may wouldn't be happy, but I'm gonna replace the lime green guest bathroom sink. 76 was a beautiful year, but it's time to move on. Do you need any help? I'm happy to swing out to Queens. Nah, this is therapeutic. I'm doing full-scale bathroom renovation. Now that sounds incredibly boring. Just wait. Once you're an old, grizzled Spider-Man like me, you'll get hyped about home repair. Anyway, thanks for covering Manhattan while I'm in DIY. Hey, my pleasure. What's the point of having two spots? <laughs> 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 gotta take out the pants, man. <laughs> Down more transmitters to get through that hack.
underground down, transmitter next. And done. Looks like Roxxon's clearing out too. Never thought I'd say this, but thanks, Spider-Man. You can go. This time. being spotted to win this challenge. Time is a factor, so move quick. Zip to the prompt to get stealth in. Hostages, eh? Sounds tense. Try crawling on walls to position yourself for a takedown. I'm not letting those spider hostages down. Gotta sneak. Auditory alert. Possible inverting for target. Auditory disturbance detected. Alert. A unit has been compromised. You're well... Oh, right. Fake people. I knew you'd save me my... Um, Spider-Man! Amazing. Love. Wish it was always this easy. Attempting to reacquire... Spider-Man. Should check on the hostages. If you're going to do amazing work like that all the time, Miles, I really need to step up. All hostages freed. Huge success. Now that you've gotten the hang of them, stealth takedowns will give you a boost in power. Nothing like being in the stealth zone. Gotta remember to bust out a few stealth takedowns next time. Some disturbing news has just crossed my desk. Spider-Man was recently involved in a nauseating act of depravity. Stealing toys from children. Is there anything lower than that? Why, yes there is, my faithful flock. 
Do you know what was found in this stolen stash? Spider-Man toys! Not only does he steal from children, he bullies them into playing with toys they probably don't even want! The nerd! The audacity! Which is why I'm announcing a new venture for the Just the Facts team. J. Jonah Jameson action figures! I have a prototype right here in front of me. And <laughs> let me tell you, this is one handsome toy. Oh my goodness, what a... Okay, here's the modern art museum. I'm the fossil hiding among the modern. Don't forget to look up. Next clue. Boom. Looks like I'm going to CODB's. Where money is king, you'll find great tunes hanging among the lights. I had to practically drag you and Finn to the Modern Art Museum the first time you came. What do we care about splotchy paintings? But your mom and I knew. We had to show you kids that there were different ways of looking at the world. Sometimes, radically different. When I saw you two in front of that psychedelic Angela Davis portrait, heads craned up and all, I knew you got it. All that orange and gold. Don't think you ever realized the world could look that way. That you could look that way. Like royalty. Proud of you making it this far. Let's see how you do it the next time. Finn and I talked about that trip for months afterwards. Mom and Dad really knew how to inspire. <laughs>